Welcome back. Top 11 live show and our favorite time of the year. That's right. It's fan week and our performances continue with the Arkansas pop singer who's feeling the unconditional support from her small hometown. Here's more from team legend Mary Beth Bird. Say, Team Mary Beth. Team Mary Beth. Team Mary Beth. We love you. I am so proud to be from a small town because the hometown love is a love like no other. People are putting signs in their yards. They're putting digital billboards up, people having watch parties all over the place. And two of my young fans from Armorell dressed up as John Legend and me. It's so crazy to say my fans. I have a fan base, like what? It's so cool. And my little name for them is the Bird Watchers. The Bird Watchers. The Bird Watchers. <laughs> I love it. The fans picked a song for you. Mm -hmm. They picked Stars by Grace Potter yes. and the Nocturnals. And I listened to it, and I was like, wow, she even sounds like Mary Beth. It kind of reminds me of being homesick. I lit a fire with the love you left behind. Being here in L.A. for The Voice is the first time that I've ever been away from home for this long of a period of time. And I'm feeling, you know, a little homesick, especially this week. So the fans, they got it spot on overall. Up on I love this about The Voice. Someone like Mary Beth can come from a small town in Arkansas and have a chance to be singing in front of the whole country. It's a really beautiful thing. It's going to be so good. It's right in your pocket, right in your wheelhouse. There's one time where I feel like I want you to maybe throw a little ad lib. Okay. I was just hearing space there. So can we just go over that end of second course into third course? So I, I can't look at the stars. I think she's pretty flexible when it comes to the kinds of songs she can sound good doing. And I think the fans picked a great one with this one. All right, so Mary Beth's mom, Lori, is with a bunch of big bird watchers at a viewing party in Armorell, Arkansas. Hi, Mama Bird. Hi, Carson. All of us here are so glad that Mary Beth is, in the, is part of the top 11. This is just some of her fans who are rooting for her every step of the way. We love you, Mary Beth. Here she is singing your fan pick song, Stars. Give it up for our favorite, Mary Beth Bird. <laughs>
Yes, Mary Beth. Mary Beth Bird, ladies and gentlemen. Beautiful. You are so welcome. Kelly, let's start with you. What did you think? Yeah, uh, girl, you just have, I love this song. First of all, it was a great song choice for you, specifically mm -hmm. as a singer, because you have this just unbelievable way to just open up when you and you soar in a note without vibrato which is even that requires more air if people don't know that and it's it's beautiful you just soar on this song it was a really smart pick yeah. all right let's see what your coach thought john yeah i i really want to thank the fans for picking that song for you because it's so perfectly right in your vocal pocket it's just you just sounded so magical all of the twists and turns that the melody take it's just it was right there for you, and you, you, you gave us power, you gave us clarity, you gave us these beautiful high notes. It was one of your best performances so far. I, I just love working with you, Mary Beth. Thank you so much. If you want Mary Beth in the top ten, you can vote on NBC.com, the voice official app, Xfinity, and by streaming Mary Beth's song on Apple Music. Her work is done tonight. Mary Beth Bird, ladies and gentlemen.